Hello, I'm Matt, and welcome to Modification Station. Hello everybody, Chuck Mice Productions 2016 back again and welcome to another installment of Modification Station. In this episode we're going to be taking a look at the 360 Crane Arm Harvey. Okay, so here we go. So this is Harvey and I modified his crane to spin 360 degrees. How I did that was I forced the arm back. You have to force it back until you hear a snap. Now the problem with this is this arm, when you first do it, it's a little loose. So you have to get inside here. You have to get inside this area here. I'm going to show you that right now. I'm going to unscrew the model. Okay, as you can see, there's this little rivet here, and you have to drum all this stuff up to get down to that rivet. Drum all this stuff out to get to that rivet, and what you do, you because you can't take this apart, this rivet is welded in or something like that, it's, you, you can't take it off, because I thought I would just take it off and chop some stuff up you can't you cannot take this rivet off and that's the bad thing um, so you have to kind of trim that stuff away and then start working at it just pulling it slightly very very slightly you have to be very very careful because you don't want to force it and snap it and break it okay so there's this little bit back here, you can't see it. Oh, this little bit back here, you can't see it. Um, but you just force the crane arm back to you hear a snap, a piece of fall out. Um, and then you just tighten this rivet. You just tug on the rivet a little bit and it should be pretty good. Another thing what you wanna do is um, for a little bit more security you want to glue the arm super glue the arm to this little golden gear you want to do that so it's not as it's not as wiggly as you can see because um, I had some problems when this engine was going along the track the arm would start moving automatically so you have to kind of Pull the gear, pull the uh, rivet a little bit to get it all meshed up tight, and it works pretty well. It looks good. I don't know why Mattel couldn't have done this. I mean, it looks so awesome with this crane arm like that. Another thing you want to do is uh, to prevent anything hitting his safety valve, or if that's his whistle, you have to kind of trim the bottom where his 27 is, just trim that a little bit so it'll make clearance so you don't have it banging into it and chipping the paint off so that's Harvey's movable crane arm yeah so let's get ready to give modified Harvey a first run another thing what you want to do is you want to be very very observant you want to kind of if you want it like this you kind of have to push it back turn it on put it back down and pull it over in place and send Harvey on his way
Okay. Thank you for watching this episode of Modification Station. Leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps. And we're almost up to 4,000 subscribers. I'm really, really excited about that. And another thing I want to show you, which I didn't show in the video because I was making half of it. I painted Harvey Side Rods Red. Looks way better. So I just wanted to show you that. So, yeah. So, thanks for watching everybody.